LEGO Fortnite has released its new patch. This patch is essentially adding three new building bundles to the game, which includes the Beachside Boulevard, Durburger, and Lion's Knight Castle. This patch also fixes a small list of bugs that affect gameplay, stability, and performance. The only issue is, is that instead of unlocking these new building bundles through gameplay, you can only unlock them by spending money. My biggest issue with this is that there is no gameplay content left for me other than creating new villages that I do not need. So spending $55 to unlock decorations and new buildings just doesn't appeal to me. Maybe if the price was much lower, I would consider it, but as of now, I feel like I beat the game and there's not much left to do other than building new designs to share with the community. Thousands of players have taken to Twitter and Reddit to voice their opinions on this matter, and it seems like overall they feel the same way as I do. I mean, I see this game as an RPG or like a mini MMO that I already beat, but there is good news. The good news is that on the next patch that's coming, I, I believe later this month, they are going to add new NPCs, there are going to be quest NPCs, and much more. I, um, I did make another video explaining all this stuff, but I think I did delete it because so many other YouTubes made it and I don't want to just have repetitive content on my channel. So basically, there is going to be more content for me to continue my RPG experience. Um, these bundles you don't need to buy. But the only thing that sucks is that basically they are half of the building materials now that are that exist in the game. Meaning that for players who do nothing but build, it can definitely feel like a slap in the face. Luckily, if you have a friend who does purchase these bundles, they can join your world and they will be able to build those items on your server. For the people like me who also enjoy the actual gameplay aspect, there is still hope on the horizon and I think that this game is not ruined and is worth playing. Comment below. I would really like to hear your guys' opinion on this. I really do read every single comment, and I really do reply to every comment. I really do like and heart every comment. So with that being said, that concludes this video, and I really hope that you guys enjoyed this. I would advise you guys to all stay positive on this matter. I know there's a lot of negative stuff being posted, and I felt the same way at first, but after I took a minute to calm down and really think about it, I realized that there is this hope on the horizon and this next patch that leaked is really going to make the game a lot better for free to play players. So with that being said, thank you for stopping by and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day.